Hey everybody, Journeyman2 here, and we're going to be playing Clickbait 1000 damage against the most clickbaitiest villain in the entire game, Ronin the Accuser. So he's not one who I usually enjoy playing, much like many of you. He is very difficult without any real payoff to the difficulty. He doesn't add any complexity or any more interesting decision making. He's very straightforward. You do the stuff that works, and you beat him. And that's it. And that's not a very interesting game Marvel Champions for me. But Nova is a hero who has a wonderful Ronin matchup for a couple of reasons. Go for champions completely neuters Ronin for an entire round. Force field projection is really good against fanaticism. Uh, the power stone is wonderful for your unleashed Nova force turns. And uh, Milano helps you get your helmet out turn one. So Nova has a really good matchup against Ronin. I did a deck on it like two or three years ago. Um, and you can check that out as well. That deck was using Vivian a lot because Vivian is really good at uh, countering well most of the game, but are also Ronin. Ignore a Icon on a side scheme, ignore the Universal Weapon for a round, this kind of thing. Um, I just am running the deck as is, no Vivian tech, but it hurts me not to add her for this matchup. Okay. Well, this is incredible. I think the only thing we want to mulligan is side by side. Yeah, this is silly. Okay, let's get the Milano. We're going to have a nutty Unleash Nova Force turn. Milano for the helmet. And we're going to flip up. We can use Miss Marvel to play Unleash Nova Force. I don't think we're going to go for the combo too early. Unfortunately, I'm going to do Helmet and Genius for Moon Girl and draw three cards. Okay. Force Field Projection is going to get us specialized training. And how are we going to do this best? So I think what we're going to do is. Nova will take two off of Specialized. One plus one from the Power Stone, ready the Helmet. Helmet will play Light Speed Flight, which will clear Specialized Training. And that's going to get us our plus one attack and draw a card. We cleared a thing for Unleash Nova Force, so we ready, and we're going to draw. And then Moon Girl can go ahead and, whoops, not, not get added to hand. Uh, but she's going to take two off of Cut the Power. Nova will go ahead and clear it. It's going to ready him, ready the helmet, and draw one more card. Wow, Symbiote Suit, turn one. That would be crazy, but maybe. <laughs> I mean, why not? Let's do Helmet and Side by Side for Ironheart. See as much setup as we can. I'll just see like mission leader or something. Team training. Uh, let's clear again. Draw. Ready. Ready. Oof. Our other unleashed Nova Force. And let's do Ironheart to ping this tough. We can have Supernova Helmet, Force Field Projection, and Symbiote Suit play Deadpool. Nova can make a basic attack for three. Draw a card here. Jesse Alexander, she readies the helmet. And then we may as well play Jesse, just get as much build out as possible. I don't, don't know if we're really going to be flipping to Alter Ego. Good cutoff guard target, sad to lose other unleash, but uh, here we are. Deadpool can go ahead and take two. At least we've got a row of chumps. We got to go for champion soon, and we're looking good. What happened to our hand? There we go. And a connection to the world man, so that's one more. Wow, if we could flip down and play suit up and get Miss Marvel back, because we have a lot of build. Just sacrifice the main scheme. But we, uh, both Unleash Nova Forces and the discard makes that not as good. I think we just stay up as for as long as as long as we can. Let's block this one with Ironheart. He's attacking two two boost cards. Okay, fanaticism and cutoff guard are gone. Two encounter cards. First one, special delivery. 
We'll exhaust the Milano. Second one, Cree Private, Quick Strike for one. Okay, Ironheart is very much gone. And this would have been great for a second Unleash Nova Force turn, but oh well. Oh well. I don't even have any build. This is unfortunate. Maybe we draw something here. So we start by attacking. Well, let's go ahead and spend the helmet on pot shot. We'll put hmm. four into Ronan or four into the private. I guess we'll put four into the private. And then we can go ahead and basic attack Ronan for three. Oops, getting down to ten. Just gonna draw a card and ready the helmet. Black Panther. Suit up, helmet, light speed flight, and innovation for Black Panther. And do we want attach suit up to him? <laughs> I think that would be interesting. Instead of side by side. Holding suit up and maybe flipping down on a future turn. And we may as well, we probably have to jump with him anyway, so I don't think it's going to be a huge difference. Innovation, heal, Deadpool. Who can go ahead and clear the man? And then we can have Black Panther clear the Kree private, I think. Still plenty of jumps. We'll hold this hand. I'm going to get a six card hand size here. If Tabletop Simulator wants to let me, no, make it a seven card hand size. Well, now we might actually be able to flip down, <laughs> which is silly. Because we got Professor X, we can do the universal weapon thing, confuse him, flip, play suit up from under Black Panther. And we have a ton of resources for it too. Real call for backup out there with the light speed flight. Alright, one, two. Let's chump this one with Moon Girl. It's gonna be a double boost. We saw one private, so that's fine. There's other private. I <laughs> just jinxed us straight up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Minus one is gonna be six. So he does take the power stone back. You stand accused. We're gonna be canceling that for sure. And then pincer maneuver. Five threat. Okay. So what I want to do is take the two damage here, deal ourselves an encounter card, shuffle that back. And then I think, hmm, I'd love to recover, but unfortunately we're losing the helmet. I think we do connection to the world mind and energy for Professor X. We'll go ahead and get a confuse on him. Take three, one, two, three. Deadpool can take two, one, two. Takes consequential. Yeah, we're probably not gonna clear them in. Let's recover. Back to four, maybe do it again next turn. Jesse, connection, draw a card, power of leadership. Not terribly helpful. Actually it is, because you have suit up. So, power of leadership plays suit up. Let's get Miss Marvel back. Let's get sidekick. And what do we do here? Light speed flight. Call for backup. And mobile bunker. For Miss Marvel. And then this for sidekick. Overriding Professor X. And really partially set up. Alright, one, two on the main. He's confused. 
we just have to just have to survive three encounter cards. Usually three. That one's fine. Gang up will surge. We don't have the power stone, so that will surge. Under fire. Oof, we should have cancelled single-minded fury. So somehow we still have three encounter cards to reveal after all that. We forgot to draw our hand. Mission leader is nice. Side by side as well. So side by side, 30, 35 damage and a tough. 35, we might have it. No Unleash Nova Force is unfortunate. And we got rid of um, Champion's Mobile Bunker, so we can't get it back too easily. So exhaust, double mental, or deal three damage to the first player. Ah, this is so nasty. We don't even really have double mental. So I think we gotta exhaust the Milano. Absolute worst card. Spend double energy, discard one card at random. Let's discard a card. Hot shot, that's fine. And then more side skins. Okay. We would really love Symbiote Suit right about now. <laughs> so let's start with Jesse Alexander. We'll get World Mind back in. Shuffle, shuffle, draw that. Nope. Strength for Mission Leader. Not a lot of great ways to survive here. I wonder if this is the turn we sacrifice them in. Because we got most of the combo. So if we don't play Mission Leader, how many side-by-sides do we get if we don't do this? Oh boy. We could recover, get the seven. Helmet. Pot shot, side-by-side. -side. Ready, ready, that's plus one. Helmet clarity, side-by-side. -side. Helmet connection side by side, helmet mission leader side by side, helmet strength. So we get six side by sides. So she's only at five. No team training. Time for some math. <laughs> so we recover. We ready? We ready? The first side by side is for two attack. Get him to eight. Second side by side is going to be for three. Get him to five. And we're going to take the power stone. The third will be for one, two, three, four, five. Six. Oh, wait, we have two attack here. Okay, we need to start over. I need like a pencil and a notepad or something. Let's take some notes. <laughs> Mid game, Ronin math. So the first attack will be for three, actually, because the combat specialist plus one from side by side. So we'll take the power stone on the first attack. The second attack will be for four. Gets, it, gets him down to three. So if he takes one from Miss Marvel and then two from Black Panther, that sends him. And that's just 25 in the last four side by sides. So the next side by side will be five. The next one, six. The one after that, seven. And the one after that, eight. So five plus seven is 12, eight is 20, six is 25. This might be it. Deadpool ping is the tough on the next stage. 
you know what? Let's let's go. Let's go for it. <laughs> Are you ready? One, two, three. Sorry, exhaust. I had to recover. Okay. Supernova helmet and pot shot. All right. Wait. First, we have to attack with Miss Marvel. So that takes him down to nine. Supernova helmet and pot shot for side by side. Already ready. Oh, we're gonna have one less than I thought because of her initial attack. So let's have to heal on the last one, I think. So let's go ahead and we have plus one right now. Got to keep track of this. So our one, two, three attack. Again, the six takes the power stone, raises the helmet. And we get the draw card. Team training. All right. Yeah, she should be exhausted from bouncing it back to hand with another damage on her. So we can do helmet, clarity, side by side. Ready, ready. Exhaust, bounce it back. Two attack. I'm oh, sorry, plus two. So one, two, three, four, five. We're ready. And the helmet's exhausted. So we hit him for five, get him down to one. Just gonna ready the helmet. Black Panther will take him to the next stage. All right. So we still have. That was only two side by sides, so we have four to go. Deadpool. We'll go ahead and ping the tough. And he's going to survive, adding an acceleration token to the min. So if it doesn't work out, we at least have a. Oh, wait, no, he's not going to survive because he get, dies to the retaliate first. Yeah. So he doesn't die to consequential, he dies to retaliate. Oops. So that's fine. Helmet. And mission leader, what happened to our, oh, it's here, okay. Helmet and mission leader for side by side. Ready, ready. Take a damage, ping it back to hand. Re-attack, or plus three. So three, six, we'll attack for six. Get him down to 19. Take a retaliate, ready the helmet. Helmet and clarity for side by side. Ready, ready, I think now we have to go for the heal. So she'll. Heal one and then take one. Nova heals one. Side by side, still in hand. No attack boost. Attacking for six again. Down to 13. Raise the helmet. Helmets and team training for side by side. Ready, ready. She heals one. Nova heals one. She takes one. Bounces back to hand. We attack for six again. Down to seven. I don't think we took a retaliate on the last one or this one. I think. I don't know. Either way, I think we have it. Helmets and world mind for side by side. Ready, ready. Exhaust. Bounce it to hand. Attack for six. So one. So we healed one. We took one from retaliate. Supernova helmet is ready. And then we just go strength for side by side. And we ready. And Nova ready is. And we're going to add the boost. So she's at a 5-5. Five, five. And Nova is at one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we are overkilling Ronin by a lot. So that would be zero, and then one, two, three, four, five. So that was it. And that was before our first deck out. So I think it was just a matter of like, we just gotta pull that trigger on the combo a little bit earlier than we think. And we were down to three hit points there. That was very, <laughs> very on the edge. So. If, if you guys are watching the three-player game from the other day, I think we definitely could have defeated the second stage of this game. I came up with this deck months ago when, when uh, the Age of Apocalypse article came out, and uh, so it's been a little while since I've like really been been playing it hard. But I did a couple of games preparing for this, and it can you gotta really remember like. You can turn on a dime from the like build or like the what you call it the stabilization phase. So you're stabilizing, stabilizing, and all of a sudden it's go time. And you gotta like realize like, oh, well I have I have everything I need. I have side by side. I've got sidekick. I've got Miss Marvel. Can I win this turn? Um, let's see. Oh wait, do we forget superior tactics?
So let's mm. power stone cannot be unattached while this is in play. So how many times did we attack after flipping him? We did one attack from 25 down to 19. So that would have been 25 to 20. One attack from 19 to 13. So that would have been from 20 to 15. And then we did one attack from 13 down to seven, which would have been actually 15 to 10. And then yeah, the last two attacks were good. So yeah, I don't think I don't think this uh, <laughs> really affected anything. Because we could go back, so we had 25 hit points, right? Deadpool pinged his tough, died to their Taliot. We are at something like seven, and maybe two boosts, and, oops, not that. I think we we're here. So we had one, two, three, four, five uses of side by side still. Sorry, one, two, three, four. So, um, yeah, <laughs> we had, we still had the damage. Forgot superior tactics, but I think the math still works out there. We'll watch it back. I don't think it, uh, it matters too much. We got too caught up into the win turn. But, so that's, that's basically what, what happens is like you stabilize and then all of a sudden the win turn is there and you just have to like realize it. And that realization um, can be kind of slow. Uh, at least for me, but maybe you guys are faster with it, and that's that's Ronan in there. So let's let's just try the twenty-five. So we we will underestimate and say we only had two boosts. Pot shots. Yeah. So let's underestimate and say we had two boosts before we flipped him. So we would attack for five. All right. So one, two, three, four. So we attack for four. Get him to 21. And that readies the helmet. The helmet and clarity for one side by side would be an attack for five into 16. And then we could do a connection for four. So four, five, six gets him to 10. And then I think the last three all had to be heals, if I remember. So that would be six. Six, six, and then like of course the Miss Marvel attack on the last one. So we overkilled him by five. If we had five side by sides that were one less damage because of Power Stone, um, it still works out. The math is still working. Anyways, uh, you can flame me in the comments if you want for this mistake, but oh, I'm not playing Ronin again. <laughs> That's a one and dunner. Um, so there you go. We beat Ronin. Enjoy the enjoy the game and let me know what you think about the deck. Click it.